Good morning, it's final day breakfast. I'm excited. Just fruit, orange juice, tea, little sweet. What's not to love? I just lied to you. I've been informed I get breakfast tomorrow as well. So I take it back, this is not my last breakfast. Went down to breakfast in the middle of breakfast. My head went a bit funny and I realised I didn't take my meds this morning. So I'm going back to do that. It's just been so hectic that nothing's on a routine. So I need to get back into it. This is the hotel lobby. Look at these lights, how cool they are. This is the lobby. So today is the last day of filming. I was told that it would be until 2am. But, not to jinx things, we're looking really ahead of schedule and it's looking like I might finish at 4pm. So this would be my shortest day yet, which I'm a bit sad about because like, I want to get the whole experience. But I'm probably allowed to stay longer and watch if I like. Um, I've got my massage book, so I'm going to go and do that. But for now, I am just about to fill out my information to head back to the UK tomorrow morning. Got to do the COVID tests. Got to do... Yeah, I think it's just COVID test today. You've got to fill out some link online, so I'm going to do that. But all in all, I've had an extremely good time filming. Everyone has been lovely. I'm hoping to get to work with this company again because it's just been great. I'm off for my massage paid for by production. It's my first massage ever because normally I don't like these things. Normally I get really nervous and I just don't like the idea. But it's free and I'm in a foreign country so I never have to see this lady again. So I'm off. Oh. Oh. This is the relaxing room where you get ready. What the heck? We're at the spa. Mum's gonna wait in this room. These are all like relaxing massage beds. And I'm getting my massage. Ooh. That's the spa area. I'm back from my massage. It was lovely. They gave me really skimpy, papery underwear, like worse than spray tan underwear. So it was interesting, it was a wild first experience, but it was lovely and I'll definitely be doing it again and I just feel all nice and like relaxed. But my car's coming to pick me up in 10 minutes for the final day of shooting, so let's get to it. This morning we've got crepes, strawberry jam, got the cutlery and some water. Yes, final day, let's go. is day three set we're going in the house everyone's everywhere so you just saw my final makeup and now we're on set me and mum are here today's the final day we're only here until four o'clock and then everyone else is here all night so we're gonna have a lovely dinner in the hotel i think this is the monitor so they film over there and then you can see it on this screen here that's a wrap i'm done yeah. We're up. Oh, done. Yeah. When I'm driving car. Okay. And then I'm going for. We have wrapped and we booked a table at the restaurant in the hotel for dinner because it's literally all included. So we thought we'd treat ourselves to a lovely last night feast, really. So we've got our prosecco coming and we're gonna have a lovely time. I didn't really realise that they'd all be person. We've got camembert, actual bread breadsticks and uh, cranberries. Now we've got the salmon, look at that, look at that, look at this. We leave the hotel at nine o'clock tomorrow. This evening we just chilled out. We went for dinner, had a lovely dinner, then mum got a facial and we went in the pool and the sauna and just sort of let's go of how busy the past few days has been because 
it's back to reality tomorrow, back to doctor's appointment and work and just normal everyday life. So I've had a great time here in this amazing, amazing hotel. I'm so glad that I got to spend more time in the hotel before we left, but now I'm packing up, ready to go tomorrow morning. So I'll probably see you then. Final day, final breakfast. Plane leaves in about four or five hours. It's final breakfast day and we've sat in the extra breakfast area and it's lovely. It's got all posh, it's so posh. This is my favourite chair in the hotel. It is the comfiest chair in the world. This is how I sit in it. love this chair it's actually perfect mum's got one in her room as well for this one if it i'm not i don't think i'd ever have it in my own house but i really like it